But uh, chat wanted to say hello to start the game. So here's everyone saying hello. My floating head, head hat. Yeah, I right now I have my green screen behind me and I have a green shirt on. But I don't know. I don't. Here, here's what floating head hat looks like. But I decided not to do it for the YouTube video. So, because most people are like, suck. don't like YouTube, don't like webcams for YouTube for some reason. All right, I'm moving you guys back. You guys are going back to the Shadow Realm. All right. So if you guys have not seen Cthulhu's kit, you're in for a treat. Oh, look at that. Look at all the God card art. Cthulhu looks way more sinister. Just like on the God art alone. Oh my goodness, dude. That's a big boy. That's a big boy. New God. Yep, this is Cthulhu. We are on PTS. Oh my goodness. Oh, I should have used the recolor. Whatever. No, people want to see default Cthulhu. So his passive is kind of temporary right now, but that's okay. Okay, so let's go a standard Guardian build. I want to try out full attack speed when he comes out with, but for now we're doing standard. Um, I am going to go Bracer. I uh, thank you for Alternative Truth for going a standard God. I wanted him to go standard God. He is pretty big. He's not like Yorm big, but he's pretty chunky. Got a different camera angle. So let's see. Sanity break. Uh-huh. Okay, so three is my escape. Okay, okay. Minions have spawned. His last all attack's a cleave. Oh. Dude, that's cool. His last auto attack is also with his passive where he can uh fly insanity. No, so for those that are watching on Twitch right now and you guys are hearing music and you're like, wait, is that going to mess up uh, YouTube? No, it actually will not because when I'm streaming, I use virtual audio cables. And what that means is that I have stream able to listen to music and I'm actually listening to music right now, but it won't come out in the recording, which is cool. Dude. Look how small Rama is. Oh my goodness. All right, so let's do let's do a little bit of this. Dude, that ability is cool. I can't believe they gave a guardian a cleave. I'm so happy. Technically Yorm, but not really. I didn't even realize Rama could steal those if I put them up close. So when I watched when I watched Pat Snow show live, this is what my chat said for his second ability. They said this is the night after Taco Bell. And I can't stop thinking about that comment. It's so cursed. It's so true. It's such a cursed comment. For his second ability. So basically insanity. The more stacks insanity has, I believe it max stacks at four, the more weird things your opponent sees. So actually your opponent will see like tentacles and stuff around the map and eyes watching and whis they'll hear whispering. And if they're high enough insanity, they'll actually hear Loki stealth and blinks as well. Just random things. And if I break them using my one, it'll actually do, I believe it'll do damage. And I'll get permanent stacking mitigation for my ultimate. I think. Dude, look at the ult. They have purple text. Is this the only is this the only god that has purple text in their kit? Oh my goodness. We gotta do the ult pretty soon. But I think my two applies insanity and my one does as well as long as as well as my last auto attack in my hit chain. I honestly recommend you guys to watch patch notes if you are confused about his kit because I'm very confused about his kit. <laughs> Also, they added minion numbers or damage or numbers to minions, which is awesome. So you can see how much health they have. I believe it's only when they're damaged or the ones you're looking at. Yes, yeah, only when you're looking at them. You're in auto attack range. Talk about ability. 
I haven't used my three yet because it's my escape slash, I guess. You could use it aggressively. It's a stun. The three is a very, very, very short stun. I think it has a stun condition, though. Hmm. He seems definitely... He also seems simple so far. Honestly, playing it, I've only been using his odd attacks as one and two. He seems pretty simple. Like, even if you don't understand his passive that well. I should do one against Cthulhu? I might. I might. So this is PTS. He is not out right now. And you can cancel that ability as well, but... It's a slow, and I think if they're high enough in Sandy, it roots them as well, which is really cool. You can also be stunned out of his two. Dude, Cthulhu's whack. I think we'll alt here. Let me just clear the wave. Well, maybe not. He's in tower. I want to ult. Screw it. We're ulting. Oh my goodness. Oh, my cat. Oh my god. That is one big boy. That is one big boy. Oh, that's a cool ability. Obviously, you can just run away from it, though. Which is kind of what happened. We're gonna use our three. Oh, damn. Does he have boots? He has boots, I don't. Dude, that's a cool ult of it. That's a really cool ult. Oh, my goodness. If you guys haven't seen the trailer for Blue, you need to see it right now. I guess Recall. He's just really intimidating. What is it you An absolute unit, dude. Oh my god, his alt feels really, really cool. His alt feels really cool. So does that, what's the stun condition on the stun? What's the, what's the stun condition on the three, I mean? He seems pretty strong though, you guys. He se Cthulhu seems very strong. His damage numbers seem very high right now. Like, look at that, oh my God. Look at that, the damage numbers. My three's only leveled up once. Okay, yeah, Cthulhu's gonna be a little bit busted on release, you guys. He's gonna be a, a little busted. I don't think he's blown a level busted, but... Oh my god, did that hit hard. It's a stun if I run into them with the dash. Okay, we'll try that here. If he, if he pushes up. It would be cool to play against Cthulhu as well. I'll be honest, when I first saw the patch notes, I thought the three was going to be a really weird ability. It actually feels pretty good to use. It's one of those things where you see it on patch notes, and you're like, that's a weird ability. That looks like a weird targeter. But it actually feels fine to use. It fits It fits with his extremely large model. It feels like it has some force behind it. It's one of those things where you have to try it yourself. Also, I think full damage is the way to go. Full damage is definitely the way to go. I think. Not cooldown. Play against Cthulhu's Rat to Oscar. Oh, that'd be fun. I don't play Rat, though. I'd maybe play, like, Scylla. Let's pick this up. Also, the buff belt is bigger. Cthulhu, that dude. This is a god I would have definitely never expected to come to smite. I do love the damage numbers above everything. No more red buffs being stolen and stuff. I don't know where he is. 
He also has a nice hit change with auto attack cancels. He feels like a warrior, but he's a guardian, which is what I love. This is the type of guardian I like. It's very Fafnir like. Fafnir and Hercules. Godzilla next. I don't think they'll have Godzilla. Okay, so that stunned him. Might be a good time to ult. Dude, I'm tall, as tall as Rama. Oh, oh my God. Oh, but it doesn't last long enough. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Wow, that escape is really long range, dude. I'm as tall as Rama. Oh. Oh my God. This is such a cool God. He's gonna need to be balanced as hell, but. Oh my god, this is fun. Didn't know you could dash and all. No, my all ended. Whoops. I don't know why I did that. My ult ended. Wish you could wave in the ult. I haven't tried it. Let's look at the emos. Do I have them? I don't. I'd have to show them after the game. Dude, this is cool. I don't have the voice back either because I'm a bad content creator, but... <laughs> Look at that damage. Oh my god. I want to go max attack to be Cthulhu. This kit just feels awesome. Look, I think I can kill him here. Look how far range this three goes. Oh my god. That is... It doesn't look far range because of how big his model is. But I think that is one of the farthest dashes in the game. Excluding like Thoth. That is re it's like... Guys, my opinion on Cthulhu, seeing him on patch notes versus playing him is way different. His three is way stronger than I thought it would be. I just every- he's just fun to play. He's everything I thought he was gonna be bum and more so far. Obviously, he's, he's gonna get nerfed, dude. He's gonna get nerfed hard, but I don't care. This ability is still cursed. That ability, it looks so gross, dude. <laughs> it looks so gross. I need to get him away from his tower so I can ult. That's what I want to do. I'm gonna get Blink also. I think that'll help me. Should I get Gem? I think Gem would fit well. I think we're gonna get a Gem. Slows just seem to be Lulu's thing. Seems to fit well with him. Unfortunately, my ultimate, my swipes don't apply item effects. Yeah, exactly. His abilities seem short range because of the way his camera is, but in reality, they're huge abilities. He, like, that's that's a Kraken ability right there, you know? I don't have wards, but... I'm guessing you can't mind break Demon King. Oh, he's coming over here. And yeah, this is dumb to do without... without... Any sort of uh, wards. This seems like standard guardian. Standard guardian thing right here. Oh, he didn't. He ulted. Hold on. Oh, this is what I wanted. Ah, ah. Wait, why did it end my ult early? Oh, I'm dumb. I know why it's been ending my ult early. All right, this is gonna sound really stupid, but I thought, okay, yeah, I, I've been ending my ult early on accident. Pressing four again ends your ult. I thought he had another ability to press four. That's why his ult was at, my ult was ending earlier. <laughs> it's it's the other abilities. If you press four, it cancels it. With most ults like that, it only cancels if you right click it. Okay, but I figured it out. Dude, that's a cool ult, though.
Would his two in his all play item effects? I think it would. When you break someone with their one, like when they're max sandy, use your one, you get you get uh increased permanent mitigation for your ultimate. It's insane. So I need to be doing that as much as possible. Dude, this as big as Titan. This god is really cool. All right, this time we're not gonna cancel it. This time we're not gonna cancel it. Let's use our two. Let's use our three. The three's not that good in uh, duo, obviously. I can't use Bracer. Oh, I can. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this is definitely a new main. I think everybody's gonna main this god. This is definitely a new main. I think everybody's baiting this god, but oh well. I'm the guardian duel guy. This is definitely the next big guardian duel. I can use Bracer, dude. It's like Vamata all. Okay, so let me get this straight. They said Baba Yaga's shouldn't be allowed to use Bracer because it's it's not a... Ch it's because she's doing stuff in her ult, but Cthulhu can use Bracer in his ult. So what the hell's up with that? If Cthulhu can use Bracer, Baba Yaga should 100% be able to use Bracer. That game was stupid fun. All right, chat. I'll let you guys say bye to YouTube. That was stupid fun. Oh, my God. This is... Oh, look at this screen. Look at this windscreen, dude. Everybody say bye on YouTube. Thank you to Alternative Truth for playing. GG well played. I'm going to show his emotes real quick before we end the video, though. All right, so let's make sure everyone gets their, their buys out. <laughs> All right. Uh, hi, me on YouTube. All right, so let's go to his wave. Because I didn't get to see his wave. Let me buy the, the skin as well. Okay, so let's buy his wave. Let's buy this. Okay, so his wave, he kind of like waves with his tentacles. That's hilarious. His clap, what does he do for his clap? Ooh, do you hear that? Listen to that sound effect. Insane. That's awesome. Cthulhu's way cooler than uh, than I anticipated. <laughs> all right. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, thank you for all supporting. And I'll see you guys next time. Adios.